Hello guys, Test 2 Pierre, and we are back for another Stanley Cup Playoffs on Son of Peace of EA Sports. This next matchup, as we're about to be seeing the Islanders play at home but the new stadium, facing against the visitor team of the Carolina Hurricanes in Game 3 and 4. So it is game, it's going to be very tough to find out who's going to take the lead in the series. Right now, both, both teams are tied in the series by one. We'll have to find out who's going to take the lead in the third game. For that being said, I have an ex-commentator here on board. We have his paintbrush, and he will be along the side. As I know yet, on the other side, we have right now is Lightfall. Center Ice will give it a first look here for Clover, and she will be trying to see what she's got here for one of the accurate uh, players in precision to find out one of the X-Factor players right on the Superstar lineups. And now it's time to send you over to UBS Arena for the third game of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. I'll be back with the post-game show after this game is over. Guys, it's all yours. Enjoy! Hello folks, Paintbrush here along with Lightbulb and this is the Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. Opening face-off of game number three underway here in Long Island. Puck is dropped and we are underway. The courtesy lineup is being as followed. We have a Jacob Slavin. Then across from here we have a Sebastian Ajo. Toward the right is Jarvis. In the center of the ice right now as the starting goaltender will be Anderson. Across in the backhand we for the Islanders we have his Pelic. Moving from alongside we have his Angvale. And then across from here we have his Josh Bailey. And the other side of it we have his Horvath. And the starting goaltender will be Sorokin. With Sorokin on a shot, he has that one a lot of, of his abusive on his run. He keeps an eye here for the open passes on that point. The last game was turning out to be one of the bestest as he has done many saves here in the game. In case you haven't even noticed yet, they have played here in Barclay Center. Then they definitely did play here at the at the S, uh, SY, the Nausea Coliseum here for the, uh, where the Islanders were home play. At that point, the reason that this one was turning to be one of the games here since 2019 was the last part of the game that was ever played here in the Stanley Cup playoffs in the second round. But now, they're here to rematch it again, and they're about to find out who will take it over with the lead. Here's Dekus with the puck. Carolina in the offense zone, picking up a steam. Stopped by Sorokin. Now he gives it off to Pelic back over to the other end. Swings it across over to Engvall. Making a move in the middle. Stop again by here by Anderson. Anderson really has that one here with a bunch of saves that he has ever done it before. If you keep your eyes here for Tara Vinen, he may have another way to give that one a shot and try to look the other end. Here's Sketchy. Shot. Stopped again here by Sorokin. Sorokin's going to throw it over to Sketchy. Pass back to Sketchy. He gets off to Nekis and goes right toward the wall with the bang of Angbell. Rebound the puck here by Pets. 16 foul now 9 to go in the first period. Bad pass leads off the mark. They will have to reset here with, with under 16 minutes to go. Now he gives it off to Nekis. New line change is Mark, Mark Stahl. Turn line in. Helich takes it over. Now finds over Paris. He gives it back over again over to Fashing. New York on the attack. Take the shot, and it's blocked up in front. Now moves over to Stahl. Carolina in the offense zone with the, with the rush attack. Sorokin will hold the carry here as Romanov takes it over. Now Morton has the puck. Nelson over to Mayfield. He gives over to Fashtain. Fashtain right over to Martin. With the shot, it's off again, it goes out of play. Both players are set, ready to take the face-off puck drop. Score is still zeros, no game in the play. Right now with the win, here's Romanov. Shot! Scores! The flick on Martin, and it's now a one nothing lead. With the good pass, that one, to keep your eyes open on that one. If the man was right open, it, trying to deflect that one. That was a better play than he has ever done before. The first goal comes in with Matt Martin. That goes with the first goal assisted by Romanov in Poland. 
What a play for a start of the Islanders in the third game of the season. Put it back in bounds. Score versus the Zikas. Oh, look at that one, that play. They trying to mess up on Anderson. Well, it seems like that really does turn out. One of the better plays, if we're happy enough to hear, the Islanders are trying to push their way in front. They're not really important to try to take it over. Stahl brings it over. Now fast has the puck. Martin brings over to Sizikas. Pokes it away. Trying to put it back in and it's stopped here by Anderson. Now he swings over to Martin. Nope. Now back to the other side. Keeps it over to Stahl. In now. Fast. Back to DeHaan. DeHaan swings to Gottesphere. DeHaan shot. Trying to deflect it in. It's stopped up by Sorokin. Stahl trying to battle for the loose puck. Sorokin will hold the puck here with 13-13 to go in the first period. Players are set, ready to take the face off on the other hand. Islanders had a great start to take the goal. It's 2-0. Now here's Romanov. Polak with the puck. Double man on him. No Sam with the puck. Jade's blocked up as Kolobkovi, Kolobkovi will take it over. Holmstrom with the puck now in the offense zone in the Kane's territory. Trying to give it to Bailey. Blocked it up. 12.30 left to go here in the first period. No sin goes back the other way, now swings off. Bailey reaches out with the end of that broken, broken pass play. Stepan trying to get over. Bailey in the corner now, bringing it over to Bullock. Bullock to Bailey. Shot! Stopped here by Anderson. That saved me, it does happen to be one of the only best in this game. When you look at the pass and offense, you want to get a good line and a look. You've got to keep your eyes on the open man. You don't want to make sure you have it right away because this is very the tough that you're going to have to try to like swing it off. Burns back outside again. Try to look for the open defenders. Chatsy outside. Try to block that one. Bailey. Reach across to Horvath. Burns with it now. Broken play here with the, with the puck move. Pass broke it up. I'll go back the airway. Nearing the midway period of the marker. They're still keeping their eyes on the puck. Ako fires and Gut goes off the goaltender. Here's Turvine in. Slides the puck over to Ako. Try to give it to Garbus. That pass broken up the play and it's Polak over. The Islanders take their possession on the offense zone. Try to give it off the run back over to Ako. Ako reaching for the other side. Try to give it the third eye. Reaching the play and the penalty is called on New York Islanders. That will be a slash call. Noah Dobson into the penalty box. That will be the first penalty kill for the New York Islanders. An easy to bound it to try to slash someone because you definitely just can't see where your puck is going. Because of what Noah Dobson has it, he was going to try to reach it across. First power play coming up here for Carolina. As for the start for the New York Islanders 2-0 in the first period. Ako wins the faceoff. Trying to give it to Suchikov. And a one-time score! Suchikov with his first goal in game three. They're now on the board and it's a power play goal. Great play here as we haven't talked about here for Taravainen. He gives it off to Stesikov right away. His moment was a good timing with the attacker, looking for open shots and keeping it right in the inside. That's a great power play and good help for the coach to give it off the run. Ago wins the faceoff. They're now on the board right now. It's a 2-1 lead. Slavin's got the puck over to Ako. He gives a deep pass to Setsukov. Trying to give the run off to him. Slows down a bit. Goes right back over to Slavin. Slavin to Burns. Behind the net is Yarvis. Try to swing it off. Bad pass broken up here. Try to pick up the play inbound. Paris with the puck now in the neutral offense zone. Try to look for the offender. Kick the pad away by Anderson. To Pomeroy. That's giving a little big out contact with the physical. Now Burns on the other hand. Passes to Yarvis. 
Jarvis looking for an open man advantage. Pass broken up. Omer over to Paris. He flings the puck up around the board. Reaching across here is Jarvis. The Canes regroup their offense back in the offense zone in an Islanders territory. Martin on the other side gives it to Stahl. Stahl shot. Stopped again by Sorokin. Sorokin with a good shot. Stopping the manage. There was a one way to give that one to tell because that was a hard one to go by. Slavin shot. Stopped again by Sorokin. Moving puck back to four of his pets. Try to look at an open man. Advantage. Puck goes out of play. Slavin trying to move over again to Petz. He gives it to Saul. Try to give it to Fax. And it's Mayfield with the steal. Tzizikas back over to Fashing. Over to Tzizikas. That's broken up here for the carry. Oh boy, hello. Oh, they're not really helpful enough. There's going to be a way too much roughing call. It is going to be very bad, bad to try to take the block shot away. That penalty is called on Carolina. They will get a holding call with Petsch. He was trying to go after him. Well, you're not really supposed to go after him with that one because the man was down. I mean, that was a very tough and brutal with the pain. He was going to try to come after him, but he was seen like he was not ready. So he was has to stay back. Right now, the Islanders are on the power play advantage with 5.29 to go in the first period. Two block shots for Pesk as he is definitely making their way down to the wire and the board. Pesk will carry the puck out of his own. Dawson swings to Bailey. Bailey almost lost the puck there, but now taking over. Try to watch the main advantage. With the shorthanded, it's Sorokin stop save. Logged in with that one and with under five minutes to go in the first period. Turn out to be that very quick for Sorokin. Keep that one up. With the third eye of the view, Sebastian Aho keeps it up here with the team and goes with the pass and it happens. He can try to open the fingers of the look. Sorokin has got a post-to-post speed here from the goalie to take a round advantage. He makes a great saves and throw back to the offense and in control. When he has that puck release, he takes it back and goes with the player to help him out. Those two are very impressive here, guys. I'll be keeping an eye here in between Aho and Sorokin, guys. Move back over to Aho. Backhand shot. Almost went tipped in. That was a close call. Almost went shorthanded for the Canes. They try to tie the game. Yeah, it's quite easier because if the play was an offense, they're going to need to try to fix it. Oh, hold on. He makes that with a good check on the moment here. And he makes the play here by, by lifting the stick up. He calls it stick up with the cross check with the correct draw. The face off is very important to keep your eyes on him. I'll be giving it out here on Orpha if he has the next one coming in. Guys, back to you. Lee in the board. Trying to move around it. Horvath shot. Stopped again here by Anderson. And Tarvine will try to clear the puck out. Now here's Pola. He will carry the puck in offense zone. He looks like he's almost out of penalty box, ready to go. Islanders carry out with the empty power play goal, as right now it turns out to be a clean on the look. Yeah, the what advantage it was very, uh, very difficult to try to maintain. The way they played it is a very hard one to try to keep him out of the range, and because of this one, it is very uh, difficult to try to keep up with the team. They're looking for power plays with the goal, but it's not really that important. So that one, it was Carolina that put up with the power play goal. They never tied it, they shouldn't have got it, and they should have gotten it in there to keep the deck out of it. Class swings to Martin up. Right from the attacker, trying to look for an open man to stall. Trying to cut into Nosen. Stopped and glove saved by Sorokin with another pad one look. Lee carries over to Pola. He swings over to Lee. Reach back to Pamir. Pamir with the one on two shot. Horvath in. Stop, shot, blocked here. Good crouch down here for Sketchy. That's really a great defense because that one's giving a good look of it. Great stop here for Sketchy. And that might be another way to try to help him save the day. Sketchy back over to the high. We're down to the last minute to play in the first period. That's good stop here by the goaltender. Dehan swings back over to Sketchy. Moves quickly to Nozen. And Sketchy goes out of play 
They will have to reforce to regroup their team. Every team, you got to stay focused. It's not very easy to try to keep the puck out of a range and then try to take him over. It's because you have to keep the players here under imbalance. That's what they need to do to try to keep him right over it. Paul Mirror's shot is off line. Oh, a big banger out here. And so it ends the first period. With a power play goal, that goes over to Teravainen, and what a shot here, and it turned out for the Hurricanes. 2-1 is the score. We'll be right back with the second period. Paintbrush back with you again as the second period is about to be underway with the game. And now we are back to do it again. Right now, the Islanders have a 2-1 lead over the Carolina Hurricanes. With a start of the first period, it turned out to be really that quick, and they go back with the run. They have done it lots much better. I mean, they're very that tough, and to be honest with you, they're paintbrush. I mean, they're getting this thing a lot of worthy credit runs here. This is really turning out to be one of the biggest plays here that we've ever seen it here before. And just a bigger time, they have to give that one off to a good run. Whenever they played here before, they have to keep regaining the group. Pelic takes back over again, to over, back over to Sirokin to Pelic. Sets a carb on him. Horvat moving inside here from the middle into the offense zone. Keeps it right to the puck in the middle. That's stopped again here by Setsukov. Firing the puck deep over again to Jarvis. Jarvis going big here. A little battle in ground here on the board. Moves back over to Jarvis. Now swings to Slavin. Slavin swings to Turvinen. Over again to Slavin, back to Burns. With a quick shot. Stopped again here by, by Sorokin. That goes off on the board. Oh, big swing of that one. Regrouping the puck here for the Hurricane Zone. Back to Turvinen. Backhand shot stopped again by Sorokin. The Sorokin shot was very increasing. A lot of players are getting on and trying to like keep him right down on the lane of an angle. They're not really trying to keep up with the momentum here. That they were trying to keep it over it again, and they got to get this one to try. Yaris goes down. Katami, oh, here he goes with the shot. Stopped here by Sorokin. The Islanders regain the group into the Kings territory. Broken up with the play. Katami swings back the pass. To Tarvinen. In his own entry, Tarvinen. Open pass to pass. With the backhand, won't be enough to get the target up here. Take away by Yarvis. Try to swing across the puck to stall. Palmieri, poked it away. Recover the puck again. Bolak swings over to Nelson, back to the off sense of the side. Trying to move in the middle. With the move around, taking an inbound here and stopped to get by Anderson. Dehine with the puck now in the offensive wing. Take the puck, and it's broken up play with a one time shot goal. Now with the one on one attack, going in the middle, it's stopped again here by Anderson. Anderson will try to hurry the puck here. Sizikas with the shot, stopped by, by Anderson. We'll get up a clean whistle here and we'll get ready for the face-off coming up. With the plate in play, Anderson and Sorokin are very that strong to try to keep it over to the stands on the side. They're really that tough. Back in game two, they really have nowhere else to go. Yeah, easy call on this one here. That post-to-post -post speed here for Sorokin was turning out one of the bestest. I mean, to talk about him for one of the most of, of the games that he really got played, it was very that tough and be honored to be uh, to go out with the lookout change. The eye into the keeping for Anderson was very that tough. Not really insane, but in that question the case, what will they do about him? We may not know what to get and give up in front of him. Burns outside again, over again. Back to Slavin. With the quick shot fired, put a rebound in there and it's stopped by Sorokin. Martin gets the puck back. And Nozin has the puck. Nowhere to go. Take the backhand. No rebound for Shasni and stopped by Sorokin. Stops into Ako. Regaining the puck in control now for Islanders. Tzizika's shot. 
Put the rebound in there, and it's uh, taken away by Slavin. Slavin on a lockdown defensive pin. I mean, that's very that tough to try to keep it over it. Here's Jarvis on the uh, on behind the net. And bad pass broken up here. All right now, Slavin will take the puck here, and we'll try to reconnect the group. Broken up the play. Fast thing, trying to like, get blocked out. Pass with the puck now with 11.30 to go in the second period of the game. Lost the pass here. Pass trying to reach the gain the group. Try to give it to Turbine. It's deflected. It goes off of Mayfield. Helich with the puck. Now moving in the inside. Take the shot in. Pass with the stop. Ajo's got it now in the offense zone to take their own time on offense. Move the puck over to Fast. And Skeggy. Try to rebound it by Ajo. Pass with the regroup. Try to give it over to Fast. In behind and out of the cage of the board, trying to look over with the offense. Losing the puck, recovers up by Tarvinen. Back to Skeggy. Skeggy to Ajo. Shot! Love saved by Sorokin. We'll hold the play here with 9.50 to go under mid-period in a second. Players are set, ready to take the inbound. The Islanders regain the group. They still have 2-1 lead over the Kern Canes. Mayfield with the puck. Try to block it out with the pass. Over to Fast. Fast to Spess. Back to Skeggy. Skeggy shot. Scores! They tie the game up. It's twos. That's his second goal in the playoffs. Now they have it tied up. All day, every day for Skeggy. That play in his pass was turning out quick. From the goalpost and the crossbar, he was able to pick up his one-time shot that was given up to a one single digit number. Now with the win, here's Pelic. And the penalty coming up for, for, New, for Carolina. They ain't got a power play coming up and this one is gonna call with a slash. That's gonna be on Jordan Stahl. Not really comfortable at all. Jordan Stahl really he has nothing to say about it, but it does mean that he's in the penalty box for sure. The power play advantage for the Islanders. It's a tie game. They could go for the lead if they take the power play goal in the game. Now here's Thompson. It's blocked away by DeHaan. Clear the puck out. Try to take the puck out of the, in the reach. DeHaan with the puck back over again to Ajo. Try to go with the shorthanded. But they have it back again here by Skeggy. Skeggy goes down. Try to regroup the puck here. Horvat has it back to Nelson. Dobson with the puck control. Now regaining group on offense over again to the Hurricane territory. Horvat with the puck. 8.20 to go. Try to flick it in there, but it's not in time. He clears the puck out with under a minute to go for the power play for the Islanders. Palmieri with the puck. Eight minutes going by in the second period. Try to move him out. Put the front. Stop by Anderson. All right, Anderson's really keeping it up with the saves. The longer they take, the more better they have the advantage of a player to try to make it, make it through. And with that one in play inbound, it's not easy to try to make it save. He's almost ready to go. Turbine in. Backhand shot stopped again here by Sorokin. And they will go back to even strengths for the Islanders, and the Hurricanes are back into the game. After a five, a struggle for fast, they were keeping it up here with the pass. Every player they have the attack in the middle, they don't have the right advantage to do that. Back to Dijon. Over to Gardespear. Swings to fast. Firing the puck over to Tarvinen. Tarvinen right toward the middle. Argo shot. Stopped by Sorokin from near the goalpost. 6.26 left to go in a second period. It's still a tie game. Now they're ready to take inbound into the advantage. The score now is even. They're still looking for a way to take the lead in the series. Now it's Corbett right to Mayfield on the other side of it. Horvath has the puck in now, passing the neutral zone to offense zone. Pelic right toward the middle, over to Lee. Lee the backhand of Horvath. 
Chuck, stop it. Anderson will have to carry with the save here, as right now under six minutes to go. Horvath wins the faceoff. Outside Pelic, trying to give it over to Lee. Lee on a shot, trying to flick it off here. Good stop here by the defender. Nose in, in the offense zone, trying to pick up the run over to Saxony. Over again, Mayfield broken up the pass. Swings to Horvath. Horvath swings over to Mayfield. In the middle, Mayfield trying to move around. And a good save me by the goaltender of Anderson. He's keeping it going with the saves here. They try to reject the shot. Rejecting is a good thing to keep his eyes on. They're very that powerful. Pass broken up. Sisikas with the puck with 430 left to go. Tie and poke away. Mayfield. And a stop made by Anderson. That goes back to Yarvis with the puck. Yarvis looks it over, trying to go with the clear man advantage. No set. Battling along the puck of the board. Avo recovers it over the pass. Back to Skeji. Swings to Pets. Takes a shot. Trying to put a rebound, but it's deflected. And Alpha saved me by Sorokin. Here's Fastening. New York trying to look over the attack. It's stopped by Anderson. Good stop made here. And they're going to have to take the inbound to go with the faceoff coming up. With another one we go for, Jacob Slavin. His ultimate range in this one goes with a lockdown defensive run. He gives it up to a player and tries to stay and focus on the bounds. The more succeed, the better he has. I'll keep an eye on you for Slavin for the next one to keep the range on the ice. Guys, back to you. Swing the pass over again to Sutchikov. Back again to Slavin, over again to Burns. Burns swings to Slavin, back again to Burns. Swing off to Yarvis. Trying to move it in, and it's back here. It's not made by Sorokin. It goes off with the pad, now back over to Burns with 2.35 to go in the first second. Stick lifted, but recovers it. Burns trying to make it way down to the line. Yarvis, pass is broken up. Moving back over toward again is Slavin. Slavin swings to Yarvis back with the, with the chance. The chance in the middle. That's stopped again with another pad save by Sorokin. Ty Burns again. Bad pass again. That's two times in a row and they keep misfiring each other. Well, it's too quick because you're trying to like say you're trying to hurry it up. But you don't want that. You want to find an open man advantage of you, and you want to make sure that the man is open wide enough so they can get the pass right of it instead. Dehan, shot, trying to deflect it in there, but it's off on Romanov. Harris in his neutral center, now in the offense zone. Passing the minute in the first and second period. That's stopped by the goaltender. Carolina back to the other end. Trying to take it over to Katemi. Katemi swings over to Godisphere. Godisphere up with the shot. That's stopped again here by Sorokin. Romanov swinging over to the offense zone with 15 seconds to go. Trying to go for the buzz beater, Holmstrom. Turn line and takes it away. Trying to go with the buzz beater, Katemi with the chance. 2 a 1! Missed out. Pass stopped by Sorokin. And that will do the second period. Their team is tied by two. Let's bring on the third period. Third period. As we close this off for the third game of the USB Arena, it is a tie game. It has been a very rough matchup since we have ever seen the Islanders seeing the uh, recap with a 2-1 over to Hurricanes. And in second period, it is Hurricanes coming back in the game to try to tie this game up. It's very a hard matchup since we've seen them playing since 2019 Stanley Cup playoffs. This really has to be happening to one of each games that was ever been reduced by those two. They are really aggressive on that run. You know, this was the only play of this one. We know Back in 2011 and 12, we seen the uh, we seen the Rangers and the Devils here playing here at the Garden and at the at the Prudential Center. That was the very toughest game that they were ever had played. But in the 19s, it, by the 1990s, it may have been just a very tough one to try to keep it out. 
The range is very difficult. They're not really trying to like try to stop the puck here with the run, but they really have it along the deck. They try to like pick them up to play and then just try to go back with it now because they don't have any ever advantage to try to take over it. That's why. They really have it a lot of it. They try to sketch it up and do it again. Here's Horvath right outside. Try to stop the deflection of Horvath. And Anderson will come in to save the game with just 17.29 to go. Players are ready to take inbound with the offense. Right now it's still tied up, looking for a next goal to late hit the marker to take the lead. Mayfield, Anderson, love save with the catch. Nice play here. In his own entry is Tervinen. Tervinen trying to look over an open man offense. Pass, pass, broke it up. Try to recover the puck, now he gives it to Kotami. Moves across the fast. He swings back to Kotami. Oh, a bang out here in trouble here. Turbine in. Try to give it the fast. Both players are in offense, try to pick up the run. Ball Mary with the puck. Try to give it back over again is Mayfield. Mayfield and Nelson. The Islanders regain their group on offense and try to pick up their run. Sketchy with the puck. Now back over to Stepan. Stepan races over to Nosen. Nosen swings the pass. Fires the puck. And he was blocked up in front, not ready to swing it off in time. Two men on him. Low bang up at the close gap, but trying to keep it alive for Kotemi. And even with the play of this one, this really has turned out. Every other team is really that difficult to try to maintain their goal. But don't get caught off if you're going to try to do it again. Sorokin stops save here. And Romanov goes back over to Sikakos. Fashing will try to regroup the offense. Kotemi with the puck. In the middle. And it's stopped off again here. And it's hit the pad for Sorokin. In the right. Here's a shot. That's stopped again here by Anderson. Swings to Stefan right over again to Shatsny. Shatsny's broken up play. Goes to Sisikas. Blocked it up by Duran. Behind was definitely going right toward it right now. They're really like showing it off again. Shatsny. Swinging from side to side. Trying to rebound the puck but it's stopped again. Skudgy trying to roll it over on the other side. Pass to Shatsny's broken up. Martin with a look. Dehan on him. Trying to move around the puck. Oh, close call for Anderson. Got a good save here for this game. Now they're keeping it alive again. All they did was keeping it up here one moment and go back to it now. All right now, here's Romanov. Pass to Pollock. Shot stopped here by Anderson with the, with the pats off. Try to race toward again. Fast on the other hand. Dehan swings to Gardespear. Try to give a pass over to Fast. Dehan will try to reset the group. Gives it to Stahl. Stahl with it now. It's blocked up. Try to rebound it for Lee. Now back to Horvath. Over to Angvel. Angle. Try to whip over with the range. Shot. Tipped it off here for Anderson with the save. The Hurricanes regain their group on offense and try to pick up momentum. Swings to Suchikov. Pass broken up as Engvall has it. Looking for an open man is Romanov. Gives it to Horvath. Trying to move the play. Lee! One-timer stopped by Anderson with the toe save. He's really trying to keep him balanced out there. Don't let him get away. Because of that one, they are going to stop the pressure. They're going to keep on shooting it. Romanov to Polak over again to Agval. Agval reaches over to Horvat. Jarvis with the puck. Trying to take away from it again. With the pass. Agos, we got it. We gained the group. Such a call. It's blocked up by the two defenders. Avo with the puck now racing forward to the offense side of the run. Avo trying to reach it in front. Yes, Slavin blocks a shot. Crouch down out there. That's very the tough one to try to leave it out. Horvath swings to Bailey. No penalty call on Carolina. Jarvis back to the outside. He fires the puck over again to Avo. 
Argos swings back over to Yarvis. Trying to reach his Sertikov. Sertikov shot. Stop the game by Sirokin. Argo with the look. No play broken here with the, with the pass and a backhand shot. That kid is off the target and trying to regain the group. Poked it away. Slavin goes down. They're reaching up here toward the Yarvis. Yarvis back over again to Sukatemi. And a pass is broken up. Bailey over to Ako again. Try to reach across to Holmstro. Ako back again to Kolobova. Kovulov's got the puck in the offense zone for the Islanders in Kane's territory. Anderson trying to reach it with the save. Passing the midway period as right now it's still a tie game. Here's this on a shot. Stopped again. Oh, went down and he lost the stick. Yeah, that looks like a defender was definitely trying to put a break of off of him. He's trying to break it off. Trying to really go with the bang, bang shot. They were really having a hard one to try to keep up again. Turbine and regroups the puck. He's looking for some open shots. Pass shot. That stopped again by Sirokin. Turbine and swings to Pets. Pass shot. Rebounded up by Sirokin. Save. Pass recovering the puck. And it stopped again with the whistle with 6.46 left to go. Nearing closer to the five minutes, five minute per time of the period, it's still a tie game. Now Pellet will swing over to Paris. Paris firing the puck over to Sketchy. Now they regroup the offense to Nelson. Broken up the play. Nelson right into the inside of the offense zone. Now into Paris. Put the move! Oh, what a save by Anderson. That keeps him out with a, with a jailbreak. Already stuck at that point. <laughs> Very good job. Nosen trying to recoup the Sassny. Sassy, pass. Open look. Reflected off again. Sketchy. They'll have to reinforce, regroup their team to try to make new changes. All with the play. They don't have anything else to say about it because that's not going to help. They have to do something else to try to regain to stop it. Chastain with the fire shot. That stopped again by Sorokin. Bad pass here. Now Anderson will have to regroup the puck here with Sketchy and regroup the change. With 440 left to go, it's still a tie game. Moves it quickly over to Dehan, right over again to Nozen. Now moves to Palmieri. Palmieri in the hustle. Trying to move to Paris. Shot! Stopped by Anderson. Martin up over again to Chesney. And he carries offside as the call is on Carolina. Under four minutes, puck about to begin with a faceoff. Now with the call, we have his clover standing by. Sebastian Apple is reaching up to his third arm. He keeps an eye open with the passing. He looks at open players and gives them good shots. Every play with the pass, he gives it all his own. Sorokin, perceiving the post to post stage of the game, he really keeps his eyes on the focus. The run is a hard one to try to keep up the run. He is very deep and very military to try to stop the shot here from the defenders on Athens. It's very the hard work part of the game and then get into it as well. I'll be keeping an eye here on Argo and for Sorokin on the other hand. Guys, back to you. Got a spear shot. Stopped by Sorokin with his glove save and only under three minutes left in the third period. Getting ready for the faceoff. The score is still even. A lot of heavy hits here and a lot of uh, battle breakdowns for in between Carolina and New York of the Long Island. They are very to try to keep the puck out of here. Yeah, the range was really that tough. Try to explain the run and they, they may not be enough to try to like keep over the passing with the puck around it. They may not have anybody else out there, but they have to turn it again. Touch a call. Oh, almost went to flick it in, but it was a close call as it keeps it out. The Islanders regain the group down in the lead. We're nearing down two minutes to play in the third period. Angles! Oh, glove save here by Anderson. Anderson keeps it not one in, in long. Try to reach out the range. They're very working that hard. In his own entry is Romanov. Romanov, pass broken up, is as Sebastianako recovers the puck. Try to move the play, and Fashning tried to take the around advantage, poked it away. 
Simon regroups the puck now back to Tarvinen. Nearing the minute pit play in the third period, Tarvinen shot, rebound, scores! It's Sebastian Ajo! And now the tie is broken up, a 3-2 game. Oh yeah, Sebastian Ajo, what a good eye. You could see that Tarvinen was giving it off to again to Ajo. Trying to make a different play at the diagonal. Really turning it out, like he did. Oh yeah, Sebastian Ajo really had a good eye on that one. And Tara Biden really had it all. Because of the shot, it really does turn out, it was a very hard in play. But thanks for Sebastian Alvo, he finally receives his goal in the playoffs. I'll be giving an eyes on him on the next goal around the corner. The main advantage of the Islanders is on. Martin, over the passing, shot stopped there by Anderson. Oh, put back save. Reaching again, good timing shot. Clear the puck down the end. No icing on the call yet, as this one Pollock will regroup. Nelson trying to hold it back. Try to regain the tie again. Zizikas blocked again. That is another great savior to try to stop here for Pesk. Oh uh, yeah, the Pesk is very that difficult to maintain its way. Terravining. Try to shoot, and he does it. The end of the game for three. And Turbine received the goal, and now they have it clutched back with an open series of the game 2 1. Islanders are reaching their trouble speed in the thing each period, but now Carolina has come back to tie the game, and now they're back in the lead. What a game, what a successful. It does happen to most people. Carolina Hurricanes wins the game, a 4-2 run over the Islanders, a great stop for Anderson and their team to make a hustle and bound. Well, as of being right now, 2-1 is a Carolina lead over the New York Islanders, and hopefully they'll be back in Game 4 after threes are put over in the game. Yeah, they're very not true, keep an eye on that one, because most of them have a tough one to keep a carry. With paintbrush and light bulb along with Clover, this has been your presentation of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Now it's time to send you over to Test 2 to close the game. Test 2, only for you. Thank you very much. Now for the three star players of the game, Sebastian Ajo with the first goal and the sixth. He really did take a clean look out of it after Taravainen with the pass. The second star on the raising on the other player we have is Tubo Taravainen. A goal and two assists. Really did turn out that Tarvine did give that one a good pass and give that one a good clean look. And your first star player of the game goes out to Frederick Anderson. 45 saves, .957 percentage of his saving ability. Awesome run. And total statistics are turning out to be on the right side of the corner of the screen. One power play goal for the Carolina Hurricanes. And four minutes in the penalty box. And two for the Islanders. No goals for the power plays at the moment. So it only had turned out that time on attack was Carolina and 537 was New York Islanders. 20 hits in the game for the Islanders are trying to keep out the Carolina zone and the Islanders defensive territory. Well, for that one being said, I hope you enjoyed this game and it took a very long expected for this run. Now, if you're waiting for the New York Rangers and the Devils, we got your next game coming up in just a few moments. Sending mine will be Jay and Greg Ferraro along with Kelly here at the Garden for Game 3. I'll be back with the post game show here once again, so keep your eyes tuned for the next one. Peace out everyone for a while as the Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports Style of NHL 23. This is Test Tube and thank you for joining us. Until next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.